Hey gang, last username here, and I'm pretty sure I've invented a new bud switch. This is a pistonless bud switch, so no pistons used, which means it's completely silent. Can come in handy sometimes. Um, there have been such things in the past, such as this old thing here. Uh, this was floating around a few months ago, and uh, it used to work, but unfortunately now it doesn't, because whatever bug it exploited was fixed and now it just goes poof and doesn't work. But um, I was trying to find something similar to this and it just so happens that another red stoner by the name of Magix or Magiapol uh, on YouTube, I don't know if I'm pronouncing that correctly. Anyway, uh, he sent me some experiments that he did um, and one of them involved redstone dust power propagation and I realized that it could be turned into a bud switch. Um, so here's roughly what it looks like. Um, got two levers here, and this one is exactly 15 blocks from the lamp. So if you turn it on, it's just close enough to power the lamp. Uh, this lever is one block further, so it's not close enough. And if you turn this lever on first, and then turn the closer lever on, the lamp still doesn't go on, even though it should. So somehow this uh, configuration of dust here is causing the power to kind of get clogged up on the way to the lamp. But if you update this piece of dust right here by, say, placing a block next to it, then the lamp goes on. Toggle the lever to reset it, update the dust, and the lamp goes on again. So what you've got here is a very rudimentary, non-resetting bud switch. And of course, to make it a resetting bud switch, all we have to do is add some uh, extra circuitry. So we replace that closer lever with a redstone torch and kind of wrap the, uh, the whole thing around so it connects with itself. And now you can see that whenever we update that piece of dust there, the torch pulses. There you go, this is a pistonless butt switch. Um, there are a lot of different ways you could build this. Uh, this wire has to be exactly this length, um, but uh, you, can, you can route it around in any direction you want. You can make it go upstairs. Um, it will still work as long as it's the right length. Um, you can also put the sensor dust up on a block like that, and that will give you, I believe, five places where you can sense block updates. One, two, three, four, five. Yep. So yeah, pretty handy. Um, hope you uh, hope you find some uses for it. I already have, and I'm going to put up uh, another video soon showing what I've done with it. Uh, but for now, I'm last username. Uh, have fun with this.